even though you have access to trade all pairs on this one account there's something you need to know right before you even start doing that this is forex market i mean the currency pairs and the synthetic indices combined together in one account so when you are trading this kindly make sure you, you keep your eye on this part which is a lot size make sure you keep your eye on it now currently this is gbp usd right so so if i switch to a different asset let's say volatility 75 the loss size over here is probably going to remain the same and if you use 0 0.1 on v75 that is very very you know big loss size and if you don't have a very big account you can wipe out your account with a little retracement right so let me show you something i'm going to go to v75 right here you can see the loss size still remains 0 0.1 and this is v75 no more gbp usd but the loss size remains the same so it's very very important that you keep your eye on it the least loss size you can use on v75 is 0 0.001 that is the least loss size you can use but on a currency pair like gbp usd or euro usd any of them let me use euro usd for instance when you come here the least loss size you can use is 0 0.1 okay those who have been trading synthetic indices are very very much aware of this already but if you've not been trading synthetic indices and you are now coming to combine synthetic indices and you know the currency pairs in this one account then it's equally important that you take note of this if not you may end up blowing your account within you know a flash i mean a second right so kindly take note of this and make sure you preserve your capital right i'll see you in the next video bless up